Hey friends, I didn't actually remember to record stuff as they arrived for my last little art haul. And as such, this one just arrived. We're at the beginning of April. There was a sale on Derwent products on Jackson's and I splurged. <gasps> and I'm really excited to have a look at these. <gasps> you ready? So let's have a look see shall we swatch them out as well because by the time i do a big video i don't know if i'll remember which ones to swatch out let me grab my sketchbook we're raring to go as you already know these are pencils oh dear oh look at these if you saw my video uh, regrets of 2023 you'll know that doing light fast were one of my regrets because i didn't really make use of them well i decided when i made my art tool wrap that i should put the pencils in there that I don't use very often, which is like the whole binder and the Durant Lightfast. And then I was like, well, I have more space. Why don't I buy more Durant Lightfast pencils? <laughs> which is what we have here. But it's a mix of Durant. So I think in total I ordered 16. And that looks to be about 16. So as you can see, there are different pencils. They're different types of Durant. And there's one Polychromos because it was the only Polychromos in my safer later in my basket. Derwent drawing, warm grey. What's that one about? I surely have that one second. So these are my Derwent drawings. Cool grey. Because I didn't order a warm grey. I have a warm grey here, like 710. And that's what they've sent me here. But actually, the warm grey I ordered was the Derwent Lightfast. Hmm, that's really annoying. Maybe they were out of stock and they were like, oh, this one will do, but I wanted the Derwent Lightfast. Anyway, no matter. Let's do a quick swatching out of these. I'm just going to hide my personal information again. So, Faber Castell Polychrome Mouse Light Green, number 171, three stars. I kind of dragged you over here. I'm still not sure how I feel about Polychrome When I use them, I love them, but then I don't automatically reach for them. But I do, when I do pick them up, I really enjoy them. It's a really beautiful green. You see that? Let's then go. There's a green here. This is a color soft lime green by Derwent. Ooh, that's pretty. I literally went by pretty in case you weren't aware. Not with the light fast because the light fast pencils. I was like, I need to make sure I've got ones that complement the existence existing collection. Is that not beautiful? That's also very very nice. Color soft lime green. I've got, um, I feel like I should show you this while I've got you here. You will have seen this. And if you want to make it, the pattern is available. <laughs> Look how mental it is at the moment. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious me. It's so colourful. <laughs> I feel like I need to make like a multi-tiered version. <laughs> So I've got so many of everything in there. And the reason I was going to show you this is, oh yeah, the existing light fast ones that I've got are, so I have the wheat, I have the golden sun, the dark honey, and this lovely lilac lavender color. We have the light bronze, which is nice. I'm. It's funny because since I've added them in here, I've been using them more and I've been loving them more. That's a luminance. I've got more in here. They must be buried because I've also stashed like the greens i've got in here like nightshade oh that's the purple forest pine is in here spruce green like <laughs> so when i was selecting the um actual colors from the do and light fast range i picked based upon what i already had so let's dive into the light fast range now that we've done those i think those were the oh hang on no we do have some this is a color soft this is loganberry i love the sound of that loganberry are you ready oh hang on that should go here because it's the same kind of oh that's so oh look at that <gasps> do you want to know what i've been looking at recently watercolor pencils because i've got the derwent ink tents but i found them so vibrant almost like fake vibrant so i was thinking about getting a small set of watercolor pencils maybe the karen dash museum aquarelle or maybe the um ba -ba -ba faber castell ones <sighs> but those are what i keep looking up at the moment is that not beautiful loganbury mm. then pimento i hear about all the time i think sandy hester sarah dyer they all talk about how amazing pimento is so I was like, well, let's give that a go. Oh, that's my kind of like, oh, mm, it's not like an orange. It's not like rusty orange. It's like a chilly orangey red. Look at that. Oh, oh, suits you. Look at that. Oh, oh. 
yummy 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 and then the other one we have is this lichen green i definitely find myself i think it's because the weather's better and i've been out drawing more and i find myself drawn to greens more often look at that <sighs> see those three together such a beautiful combination oh yum 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 even that one as well actually the whole four then the other non-light fast one we have is pebble by chroma flow sarah dyer did uh like she does in her patreon she does like reviews of um or she, like swatching of collections of colors and she said these are really narrow and she doesn't like them i see what she means like they're really narrow like you pick it up after regular pencil and these feel like nice and solid in your hand and this just feels like a thin scrappy piece of wood i'm not sure about that okay let's put it here pebble i also got this one for the name uh, it's like a warm grey. It's nice. I might have that one upstairs in the bedroom for when I want to do sketches up there. I need to pick out the ones that I've got like similar. Put some upstairs so I'm not carrying stuff up and down all the time. Well, warm grey. One of those can go upstairs because I've already got this. Do a drawing. Look. Oh, it goes on really nicely though. Look at that. I can't believe they didn't send me the light fast one. They must be out of stock. That's really nice as well. You see, it's quite similar. This is just creamier. This was a little bit drier. Okay. Then we have the light fast. You can grab them all up. So we've got a selection. I really should have written these down. Writ written. Written. I haven't done that. I will do it. And then I'll put um like a photo over the top. This one is dusky pink. I'm so glad I ordered this because I keep seeing this pop up and I'm like, it's such a pretty colour. Look at that. Oof. Goes really nicely with these three. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Then we'll do Mars orange, which should be a darker. Yeah. Darker and warmer. Look at that. See, I do feel like these are... I think my problem is I didn't like the Golden Sun Derwent Light Fast. It felt really like blotchy when I put it down. But I don't have that problem with other Light Fast pencils. And I think I allowed that to impact on my thinking. This one is scarlet because you need a red, don't you? Ooh, it's a bit cooler than the Pimento. Mmm, nice. Then we have a yellow ochre because I always need a yellow ochre. Can you see that? Oh, that's nice as well. That goes down so much nicer than the Golden Sun. Let me get the Golden Sun. Hang on. So I got the Golden Sun and Dark Honey because they are both problematic when I put them down. Can you see how it's like, like it just feels like it's a bit uh, sticky. Hang on, let me get my pencil sharpener. And this one's the Dark Honey. And this one I get the same sticky, weird, doesn't quite lay down nicely. Can you see like the streaks? Whereas all the others seem to be fine. It's just these two colours I've never really got on with since I got them. So there you go. I'll stop naming now, sorry. Right, then I just got a regular yellow. Oh, that's pretty. But again, that looks like it's trying to... Maybe I just need to not press down so hard. Maybe I need to be gentler. But that is a really beautiful yellow. It's a really lovely yellow. Then we'll do green earth because it's green. Oh, yeah. So I'm not going to do the blues alongside this because I have so many greens from Durant Lightfast range. I'm going to leave the space to put those next to it. Nice. Then we have Mid Ultramarine because I don't have any blues for the Lightfast range. I was like, I better get a couple of blues. They're quite, this one feels really dry. I'm trying to be scratchy. And then the Mid Blue 70%. Oh, that's much nicer. It goes down much nicer much softer and creamier look at that oh that is a beautiful color it's slightly turquoisey love it this is pine so i do love these greens i've been using these greens quite a bit spruce i'm doing these as smaller blobs so i know that they are different forest this one's like a kind of like a dirtier brownier kind of green and then I think that's the last green that I've got. I love this colour. This is nightshade. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Can you see that? Beautiful. And we've got the two orange yellows. What are we missing, friends? The wheat. You haven't seen the wheat. You have seen wheat before. And the lavender. Oh, and the light bronze. I might as well just do them all now, mightn't we? Okay, light bronze. Let's do that here next to this one. I really like that one. That was gorgeous. Wheat. You can barely see wheat. And this one's beautiful. Wild lavender. I've been using this a lot as well. See? So those are all my... That's not... Was it... What one was that? That was the warm grey, wasn't it? So pray that out. So these are my, like, light fast range now. I'm quite happy with those. So those are all doing drawing... No, they're all drawing 
coloured pencils apart from this one which is the polychromos hey hey this is just a quick top up video to share some some actually i don't want to use that one <laughs> sorry i'm a little bit all over the place i got back from the uk on sunday today's tuesday we arrived on sunday evening to a flood the cat sitter who i paid good money to seemed to be incapable of turning a tap off and had created a flood which has been a disaster our ceiling has fallen down and yeah that's great fun i think i'm going to do them here so when i was in the uk i saw my dad and i had a selection of pencils delivered from jackson's during the faber castell sale i had used some uh affiliate credit which is basically if anyone buys anything from Jackson's using the links that are provided in my video descriptions, then I get like, I think it's like 5% of their value of the order. Um, or it might just be the products, I'm not sure. So I'm just going to pull out the ones. Hang on, I'm going to pause this and pull out the ones that we new. So there are 15. They're not all polychromos. I think I've got like 10 polychromos, which were in the sale. And then these are two luminance I've been trying to get for my local art shop for ages. And they're never in stock. We got warm earth five percent uh number seven four one and burnt ochre ten percent eight seventy so i'm excited for those i also got a derwent light fast i know if you've seen my video the christmas ones i wasn't a fan of light fast but i have been using them loads lately and now i like them it's not that i wasn't a fan it's just that i wasn't really using them midnight black because i don't have a single black pencil like black coloring pencil i have graphite but and i have the pit oil pencils so then we have polychromos and i've got a selection here i'm gonna zoom you in and i'm gonna swatch them out with you because i may or may not post this video on friday with a few other pencils that i swatched out a couple weeks ago yeah it would have been about two weeks ago now beginning of april so ignore that fresh maybe we need a different page the light's a bit deaf as well because it's on the afternoon i've been like just binging youtube and not youtube patreon videos today because i'm a bit down in the dumps with the flooding and everything it was lovely to go home though it was my niece's wedding my elder niece not my younger niece my younger niece is too young to get married she's only 10 183 light yellow ochre i'm going to do them in kind of like a tone like a color i haven't written these down because cadmium orange 111 i realize you can't see that i'll write them down after and i'll take a photo or show you them once i've done that this should be raw umber yeah 180 and i've really been loving the polychromos that i put into my pen roll my diy pen roll then let's do the greens let's start with the coolest green like the lightest earth green 172 You're probably thinking, if you've seen any of my swatching videos before, you're probably like, whoa, she's doing bigger swatches. Normally I'm a bit skimpy because I don't want to waste my pencils or any of my supplies. This is May Green 170. But now I'm just like, you know what? Let's just really use what I've got. Because David saw my tool roll. We were on the airplane and he's like, you've barely used these. I was like, no, I have. Look, you can see. And I showed him the shorter ones. He's like, yeah, but still. I'm like, it's only because I'm trying to like not run out. Let's go with olive green yellowish. I've actually used this quite a bit while I was in the UK. I got to my dad's and the first thing I did after giving him a hug and having a cup of coffee was dash upstairs and I got the box and I took it downstairs and swatched them uh, while we chatted. Pine green 267. And I basically just wanted to top up my greens because I don't have an awful lot of polychromos greens and I'm loving polychromos a little bit more than luminance at the moment. But you'll find that out at the end of the month when you get to see the what I've been working on. Then we have, should we do the pinky one? This is Coral 131. Such a gorgeous colour, look at that. I'm probably not ooing and ahhing actually, am I? I'm normally ooing and ahhing. But I've just, it's very unlike me. I'm really down in the dumps at the moment. Light Magenta 119. We um, had a cat sitter, which I spent good money on through a company. And the reason that I use a company is because they have a guarantee. So if anything goes wrong, like there's an insurance. Well, it turns out that they changed the policy recently and there's no longer any um, cover for accidental damage. Violet 138. They only actually cover if you have um, an issue. Like, oh, I'm so sorry, I jigged you. Uh, they only cover it if there's an issue with the cat and vet pills. 
which is more than a little bit annoying because the work that we need to get done is going to cost thousands and thousands. 138 violet. Did I tell you that one already? Blue violet, 137. But the other reason, so the reason I got these is because I don't really have any like purples or violets. I was looking for one the other day, beginning of April, kind of every day. Uh, so I can't speak of the day not every day uh just to do some like shadowy cool tone shadowy and i didn't have anything suitable so those were, that's why those got added to my basket dark indigo i really have one of these and i love it it's one that i've been using quite a lot it's so different to the luminance dark indigo which is a favorite of mine as well like look at that isn't that beautiful it's a really nice kind of like dark gray indigo like a dark gray blue such a good color and then i also got midnight black from do and light fast and this is a really nice look at that Oof, it's all it's like a blue black but a really darker 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 one it's like if you added a bunch of black to indigo that's what you got with midnight black and then the two luminance pencils let's do those first let's do the warm earth five percent isn't that lovely look at that i think this green with this and this is just a great combination i'm going to swatch those out over here actually so we can see Like, isn't that a lovely little colour palette? So beautiful. My cat's decided to go in her toilet, so you're going to hear her clunking around. Boon Ochre, 10%. I just gave her a cat treat. She was, like, all dopey and being cute. And I was like, oh, do you want a little treat? And now she's like, oh, I must go to the toilet, Evie. See, beautiful colours. Really nice for skin tones, I think. Doing life drawing. I think that's my, that might be why they've been on my to buy notes on my notes phone for so long. I think I knew that they would be good for skin tones, like to do live drawing and stuff, but I've just been so, every time I go to Van Beek, my local art shop, they don't have them. So I was like, well, I'm going to UK, I'll get them from Jackson's. So there you have it, friends. That is a small selection of pencils. I don't have any other new supplies because I have not been buying art supplies, but I thought this might make a nice little top up video. So I will probably share that this Friday. Thank you so much for watching. My apologies that I'm a bit down in the dumps. Hopefully my next video I'll be a lot livelier and thank you for watching. If you made it this far, please do give the video a thumbs up because it lets me know how many people have actually been watching it all the way to the end. And feel free to leave a comment. I love chatting with you in the comments and I will see you again next week with a new video. Take care. Bye. Do we do we do do you wanna watch another one? Yes you do. Choose one of these. Thank you for watching. Bye.